easy unity can be. And today, we see from all across San Francisco labor, community groups, immigrant rights groups, we all stood together in the streets of San Francisco and shut it down and showed Trump that this city is not afraid and we will stand with our immigrant sisters and brothers, with our Muslim sisters and brothers. Sisters and brothers, family, this is San Francisco, right? San Francisco, where are you at? My name is Terry Vallon. I'm with the Filipino Community Center. We're part of a national alliance for Filipino concerns. And I'm also on the international coordinating body of the International Migrants Alliance. This struggle in San Francisco with Filipinos, with Chinese, with Latino, with Arab, with African, with the Middle Eastern, Muslim, South Asian communities of San Francisco, this beautiful San Francisco is an international struggle. Today is International Workers' Day, right? May 1 around the world is celebrated by workers. I went to Cuba in 2015. One million people today. One million people around the world. In the Philippines, hundreds of thousands. All across the world, people are struggling every day. And this struggle that we wage in San Francisco for our lives, for our communities, for housing, for immigrant rights, for workers' rights, for women's rights, for LGBT rights, is part of that international struggle for workers' rights and migrants' rights around the world. We knew, we knew that Trump was not going to stop at the border. When we stopped him at the airports, right? We stopped him at SFO, right? Yeah. We stopped him at every airport around the world when he tried to do the Muslim ban. We stopped him when he tried to do the Muslim registry. We said that we had the right to stay, the right to return, the right to go home, and the right to move if we want to. And today we assert on May 1st International Workers' Day the right to resist. Filipinos stand with all communities around the world because they're trying to divide us. Trump tried to divide us with fear, with hatred, with bigotry, with xenophobia, with Islamophobia. But when we stand together, when we are in solidarity, when we build this solidarity and strength, we have the sanctuary, the unity, the organization, and the alliances we need to build. This community is what's going to protect us. It's what's going to, it's going to defend our rights and it's going to uphold all of our communities together against Trump. And once we get Trump out of office, because we're going to get him out of office, right? Yeah. We're going to get him out of office sooner rather than later. And when we get him out of office, we're going to be stronger, fiercer, more internationalist, more united, more organized, more powerful than we ever were before. So thank you for having us here today. The International Migrants Alliance stands with all peoples, the Filipinos, Latino, Chinese, all of the communities in San Francisco. We are here today with you. We are here with you around the world. Long live international solidarity. Thank you so much, brother.